Welcome to our channel. I'm Sue, my husband AJ, and our cat is Quip. Last year we sold everything and bought a boat to sail the world. Subscribe, join us in this journey. We have a new video every week. I love it. Well, welcome aboard our 46 Lagoon. Uh, we've been living on the boat since uh, November. So that's uh, about 10 months. 10 months. <laughs> it's uh, been an adventure, that's for sure. We never let the grass grow. We keep on moving. So uh, yeah, here we are at the bow. We have a nice trampoline here. We uh, lounge out on it and chill. We got the anchor, we got the bridle. We got squid um, port side here. The first hatch we have a the captain's head and it's got storage in there. We won't uh, have you look at it. It's pretty gnarly in there. And then on directly on the other side, on our starboard four peak, there's a bed in there for the captain. Right now it's storage for our code zero and other miscellaneous things, ropes. Uh, our starboard side under the cushion there, that is where there is more storage, extra anchor. Middle compartment, that's where we have extra diesel cans and water tank access. Under this port side, we have generator access. And then uh, there's our flybridge. And, uh, you know, everything on the port side is our guest rooms. We've got the guest room and the VIP in the back. Um, so, come on. Here's our flybridge. We got a nice uh, multiple winches on this side. All the sail this one sheets we broke last, come to here. Last month, right? Yeah. We changed this part here. Did you? Locked. We have all our instruments, engine controls. We got the lounge here. This is where Sue spends most of her time. <laughs> here we are uh, on our aft deck on the flatbridge. Um, these solar panels used to be on this arch. We uh, removed them and mounted them here, and we're going to extend this arch and put uh, three 450 watt panels on here. And uh, we also relocated two of these 120s up there. So we have 240 on the very top, and then we have another 240 down here, and then we'll have about uh, 1350 watts. So it'll be like, uh, what, what was it, like 1800? Just under 1800. So 17 something. But, uh, yep, so this is access. It means I'm gonna have a longer and hot shower, right? No, the solar doesn't charge the water heater. What? No way! <laughs> Why not? It's not that much power. It's the wrong, it's the wrong one, so let's buy another one. <laughs> uh, we got storage under the seat. Storage. Oh, somebody organized this. It was a mess. Still looks like a mess to me. Um, back here we have a fridge. Got some. Ooh, I want some crown. And we have an ice maker. Um, I prefer this trash here outside, so keep the smell out of it's, my galley. This is supposed to be a cooler. Drink cooler. On this other side is the propane locker. Propane locker here. We've got these nice double doors. And uh, welcome to my galley. <laughs> 
We got the galley here, Sue's galley, another fridge. Um, there's more storage up here. Over here we have our countertop RO unit. And then we have a coffee maker, toaster, uh, step down transformer. This boat is a 220 boat from Europe. So we, if we want to use a 110 appliance, we have to use this, but it's not a big deal. Um, and we also have our microwave here. Um, we don't use it that much, mostly because it's um, where we'd have to turn on the generator because it's too much power draw for the uh, inverter on the batteries. Or just when the boat is running, right? Yeah. So when the boat is running or the generator is on, I use, but I almost didn't use. Oh, and the, our dishwasher I never used. Yeah, why don't you use a dishwasher? I use it in storage. I think it's, you know, it's just you and I. It's not, it's not a lot, you know? Mm. I prefer doing it myself. We have our uh, starboard port side uh, refrigerator. And then this side. No, let's keep going here. Okay. Opa, opa. It's under the sink storage. Lots of stuff for cleaning. Our fire extinguisher. Sure. Fire extinguisher. Yep. Fire blanket. Fire extinguisher. And the fire blanket if something happens, right? Yep. Of the oven. Uh, one thing we had to change when we got the boat into the U.S. is we had to add this button, the uh, solenoid on and off. Whoops. Uh, for uh, propane, this was a butane boat, but we moved to propane. And as per the Coast Guard, um, you're supposed to have a uh, on and off solenoid switch for propane. And then next we have our oven. This I use a lot. A lot? Yeah. What, once a week? It's a lot. It's more than the microwave. Oh, okay. Well, it is not that super hot. takes a while. Yeah, it's a but gas oven. Got better our, than nothing. Got our junk drawer, uh, quick tools. Oh, there's a mess. No. Okay. I have here all my spices, fruit. Okay, we got our trash can. Oh, our new trash can now. This one is huge. Yeah, this one. And I can show my magnet here too. Uh -huh. We have uh, in some storage here in the uh, in the ground. We have three of these compartments. One, two right here, and another one right there. Um, we also have uh, storage right here. Which are most of my tools. Looks small, but it's a lot, of, lots of stuff here, right? Yeah, there's a good amount of stuff in there. It's it's really good this one. Um, okay, let's go over here to this side. We have the uh, our fridge. This is a uh, fridge, nice pullout in it, and this is our freezer. So, yeah, that's good. And we have our bar, and. Uh, this is where we keep flashlights. We got more storage, camera stuff, um, binoculars, cups, the bar on this side. Um, on this side, there's a subwoofer, and then there's some storage under here, but it's mostly AC units. There's two of them, so there's not much storage in here. We got books, fan, um, our desk. There's our desk and our chair. We have the nav station here. There's also uh, some storage right here. And then you have your crock pot. Oh yeah, it's I mean saving. The... It's saving me a lot. No, it's the, what's it called? It's the air fryer and air the fryer. pressure cooker. Yeah. It's the same thing. I have to, we have to turn on the generator or Empty. the boat has to be running. So don't kill our battery. Yes. Okay, do you want to take them down into the uh, port side guest quarters? Yes, let's go. 
Okay, here we are. Um, we're just entering. Squid's up. aquarium. Yeah, there's the aquarium. There's the port side. Um, well, this side, the mass side first. The forward side here is our guest quarters, aka storage. Um, I'm working on some solar stuff there. Yeah. And um, we're getting ready to uh, take the Isinglass down so we have um, to have this area clear. It's warm in here right now. It's, we have um, the, this is Squid's head and uh, storage. That's our luggage. Yeah, we have no place to put this luggage, so bad. Better right here. Yeah. Squid's toilet. Uh-huh, our cat has the bathroom. Squid's got the head. Do you want to show him the closet? There's some storage behind the door. So that's nice. We have uh, some towels. This is like our linens closet, life jackets. This closet is bigger than my side. I don't like that. Oops. Um, okay, moving towards the stern or the back, we have another cabinet here with some of our first aid stuff, some flares. And then this is the uh, VIP cabin, another guest cabin, which looks like Sue made the bed. It's nice. It's organized. This one, the another one is changed. Sorry. So, yep, there's lots of uh, storage in here. This is a closet, scuba tank, sleeping bag. We have a hat over there. Fire extinguisher and more storage. A small storage right here for shoes or something. Here's some more storage. We got some clothes and some boxes. This one opens pretty good too. Got toilet paper and paper towels. Oh wow. Or loaded up for a while. We hit a Costco a couple weeks ago. And then we have the uh, VIP uh, guest head, um, shower, and their head. So. That's it for the port side guest quarters. Want to turn off the lights back there? We can serve energy. Okay, come with me and we'll show you the starboard side owner suite. Here we are. You walk in and go aft. We have our bed. Which is a nice uh, clean bed. We got vents. Put the vent in the bug thing. Yeah, nice. Got a little, we got a closet with some shirts and jackets. We got more storage under the bed. Socks, get more stuff, and then shoes in the bottom one. Um, here we have blankets, uh, paperwork, band aids, stuff, hats. Um, behind the door, that's no, okay. You're gonna open this. Behind the door here we have access access to the uh, electrical stuff um, inverter and breakers for winches air conditioner breakers and everything you can imagine okay open sesame and uh, yeah, that's it another aquarium on the side Everybody, you like the aquarium? Huh? What's up? Okay, maybe not. Um, right here we have a little desk here, but it's just not comfortable. Um, but it's a little area. Do you ever do your makeup here? No. Um, going forward now, 
we have more electrical goodies. Um, some relays and some breakers and big breakers. And then uh, we have more storage and drawers. So sunglasses, there's more drawers here. And we got more closet space. Sue's stuff. More here. Access to um, some valves here too. We got our map. We're gonna start marking it up where we've been, but uh, maybe on a different one in a better way. Okay, going forward on our starboard side, we have our head. We have a, a nice sink and a toilet in here with its own hatch for ventilation. Okay, moving all the way forward, here's our owner's uh, head or shower um, where we have our nice shower and a nice sink and there's storage for towels and linens. Yeah, lots of storage for goodies, toothpaste. Got a closet here. Uh, trash. Sue's stuff. And we have our washing machine. And I think that concludes our tour, right? So we hope you enjoyed our Lagoon 46 as much as we do. Um, and we live and breathe it every day. And that's a nice boat.